get ready for this next fight, I might as well tell you, to my right is a two-time United States Olympic wrestler. But I say this without that caveat, wrestling's the best base for modern-day mixed martial arts, and his wrestling is truly as good as it gets. As good as it gets, and he lives by the model. He embraces the grind. He gets out there, and he tries to punish you with his effort. He wants to punish you with his intensity, and he wants to overwhelm you with his pressure. That is wrestling. From the wrestling on the mat to wrestling on the feet, it's pressure, pressure, pressure. And this young man is just literally, uh, he personifies the style that so many of us were known for. Yeah, dude, like, pummels all day. His wife's yeah. like, I'm looking for a hug. You don't need to hug <laughs> Tremendous wrestler. We'll see if the hands have developed a little bit, but certainly a good opportunity on a big stage for him here tonight. to let him back up. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You gotta go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. You cannot back off. Take your time. Oh! Pretty good work with the ground and pound here by the Korean Super Bowl. All right, trying to pass here. 
As good as Teixeira might say, not today. Not today. Great job of following with the hips, keeping those legs locked and keeping them in full guard. Oh, slick reversal right there. Getting them out here. All right, working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you got to be careful here. Under a minute to go in our opening round. All right, well, he continues to manhandle him here on the ground. Now maybe trying to get to a choke position here, DC. Amir Khani's back to the side control now. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Posture's up now. Oh, and delivers. Huge punch to the head there. Another ground and pound strike gets home. Second round, straight ahead. All right, there goes the horn. A lot of damage done over those five minutes. Two knockdowns, a big round from Chor. really hurt him there, okay? He's in trouble. There's no way he's going to recover. I need you to get out there, and I want Straight right hand, no good. Oh, oh, he gets back up. The question is for how long? His misses are in the Got his guard pass. All right, he's got him in the north-south position. Amir Khan is trying for the Kimura submission here. Oh, he's got the Kimura position locked in now. Locked in on the Kimura now. Now he's got to get his knees above the head. Separate the arm from the... Oh, he's out. The fight's going to continue. Oh, my goodness. I thought it was over. I thought this fight was over. Massive shot from the top. Another ground and pound strike lands. Man, isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motion on the mat. Well, he's on his back, but he's moving his head on the ground pretty well defensively. Amir Khani's going for a choke here. That's in pretty deep. Oh, so how about that? The offensive fighter bails on the submission now. Very smart. You got to keep position over submission. Well, not good body language from his opponent here, DC. He's curled up. No, he's exhausted. He's been beaten. Amir Khani's in half guard. Oh, right into Mount. Under two minutes now to go. Well, the ground and pound has been on point tonight. Good work here by Makwan Amir Khani. Nice. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Making all these shots count. And very effective with the ground and pound. Yes, smart adjustment, yep. 45 seconds remain in the round. Amir Connings has got full mount now. Posture's up. Oh, and he lands a brutal strike to the head. In the half guard. All right, right into side control, upper body strength figures to be put to good use here. Yes, absolutely. And you gotta look for his opponent. Gotta watch his neck. Oh, and there's.
there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You see, he was nearly caught in a submission there right at the end of the round, saved by the bell. So back to the stool, mentally probably not in a great place here. We'll see if he can recover and get himself back into this fight. So the horn sounds after that round. Might have even been a 10-8. Big round there from Choi. All right, let's check out some of the action DC and how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. Everything's precise. He's a sniper. We always talk about how he's a sniper. He is a sniper. And it showed in that exchange that allowed him to drop his opponent. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. Good punch, Land. Oh! oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Well, it looks as though that strike maybe opened up a cut around the eye area. Yeah, it looks like that strike opened up a cut, John, but it's nothing to worry about now. But he's got to start to protect. Oh, another heavy shot gets through. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. All right, north-south position now, DC. We'll see how he chooses to advance from here. He's got a big through starting to form on the right side of his body. Inside the closed guard now. I mean, he went right into his full guard. What does he do to try to advance himself to give him more of an advantage on the map? Oh, reverses the position now. Outstanding work on the ground by the Korean Super Bowl. There it is. Now he's going to mount. He's got to be careful here. All right, so he just decides to get up here and let the opponent up. Now some separation. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on his... Well, at this point, you see, I'm not sure if he's just batting his time or just trying to get some extra reps, but go finish that. It seems like the guy's playing with his boot. You know, he's having a good time out there. Everything's working. He's in the zone. It feels like at any moment he can end the night of his opponent. But he seems to be having fun. And hey, to each his own, I guess, I'd be rushing out of that opportunity. Yeah, you don't play with your feet. No. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. And he is back up to his feet. Another takedown land. Amir Khani's looking to pass in the half guard here, but he's denied. All right, so he's dealing with some swelling upstairs, and you got to think his opponent is going to continue to attack that region. Well, he has to. He's starting to see now the work that's being done. He's starting to see the benefits of the work with the swelling that's starting to occur. Oh, he gets the takedown late in the round. Very useful here towards the tail end of the frame. Triangle attempt now. Oh, look out, folks. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. So the fighter was really caught in a submission there just as the horn sounded. Safe to say he was saved by the bell there. So back to the stools they go. 60 seconds to recover here. We're going to fight on, ladies and gentlemen. Another round coming up. All right, no Telestrator for DC tonight, but we'll get you some replays. And if you like face punching, that was a good round. Yeah, where's my Telestrator, man? I want to draw this action. But yeah, John, you're right. It was the striking, it was the punches that really did allow him to take control of this round. You ready to fight? You ready? Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five, five, five. Nothing in the unified.
unified rule says you can't strike from off of your back, and he did well there. Let's go, we got a scramble here. Great ground and pound by this man. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, oh, now he's gonna find himself in a little more danger. Amir Khani's in half goal. Might be a submission attempt here, Chandler. I mean, you cannot sit in a full guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities. Well, you know I don't like the gi very much, but I have an appreciation and a healthy one for these type of transitions. You can tell he's been in the gi at some point in his life with the way that he moves so freely. I'm skipping jujitsu next week, too. <laughs> Under three minutes now to go in the round. Oh, big pop from the crowd as they get back to their feet after a pretty... Oh, yeah. For now, DC, some people believe this is nothing more than a stall tactic. What do you think the offensive fighter is trying to do? He needs to regain his posture, right? He needs to shove that foot down around his neck, shove it down, build your base, get that arm free, and then get back to work trying to advance position to your ground and bomb. Right. If you play in there, you can find yourself in a lot of danger if you're not careful. Look at that. Recognize he was about to lose position. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now try to hip escape. Amir Khani's looking for that arm triangle now. Oh, he's in trouble here, DC. He's got the triangle with a lot of pressure going down. Oh, he got out. How good is that? This guy is so aware. He never leaves anything alone to allow for himself to get subbed. Under a minute to go in round four. Oh, huge ground strike there. I can see the cup man's actually getting excited. Now. Landing strikes nicely here from top position. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Choi's in half goal. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, so what a round it was for him. Multiple knockdowns. When we sat down with him on Thursday, he said, when I touch guys in this division, they go down, and he proved prophetic. That's exactly what happened in the previous round. The guy has lightning in his hands. Every time he is landing, he is putting his opponent on his butt over and over, knocking him down. He has not found the finish, but he needs to stay patient, find the perfect shot, Hit him with that kill shot. You get that kill shot off, and there will be no more getting up. All right, let us look back at some of the action from that previous round. DC punches in bunches. I mean, over and over, he landed that big punch, and every time he landed it, he got the reaction that he was looking for. His Ready opponent time. really did start Ready. to take notice every time he was loading that strike up. Oh, <laughs> 